Hey, everybody. Two boys. One brain cell. I'm Joel Norton, and this is Charles Beeson on my left. What up? What are we reacting to today, Chuck? We're going to check out, ooh, From Here to Utopia. Doing some Pat the Bunny. Pat the Bunny. All right, this is a comment request. Um, and you know, I gotta, I gotta say, I, as much as I've struggled to get into folk punk, yeah, like I'm very hit and miss with it. I think I gotta say they they might have the best fan base. Yeah, just because like I haven't rated a whole lot of folk punk very highly, mm-hmm. and every one of the comments has been really understanding. It's like, hey, you know, might not be your thing, but. We appreciate it, you reacting to them. It's just something so different. It's it's unique. Yeah, yeah. So I uh, I think we've checked out one, maybe two by Pat the Bunny. Uh, I believe it's two. Is it two? Yeah. You remembered, <sighs> guys. It's it's a, it's a it is officially a holiday. <laughs> <laughs> Chuck remembered something. <laughs> Hashtag Chuck remembers. That's today, baby. <laughs> Oh, uh, you just want to jump right in, bud? You know I do. All right, let's send it. Sorry about him. He talks too much. So, lyrically, I don't exactly connect with this, but I I am enjoying his vocals in the Yeah, I like the vocals. And the instrumental's not too bad either. I like the yeah, the kind of head bouncy. Yeah. Kind of with, with a guitar the way he's yeah. kind of yeah. And then the just just the I mean fuck the police. That That'll pretty, grab my that attention. Was a, that was funny. <laughs> 
No, I really like the vocals, though, too. Yeah, his vocals are good. I like when he kind of picks it up a notch, too. Yeah. That's fun. Yeah. Um, I'm what? I have no clue. Me neither. I just want to hear the rest of the song right now. We can jump right back into it if you want. Well, let's do it. Okay. Why wait? All right, let's do it. I do got to grab the lyrics on my phone, though, real quick. Yeah, go ahead and do it. Do you want to do it while you're listening? Yeah, that's fine. So if you guys see him on his phone, he's just looking up lyrics. Facebook. Don't know where I fit between the vegans and the nihilists. That might be the first thing I've said. That wasn't a lie tonight. Cause there's gotta be something more than lying in the front yard naked screaming at the constellations. I want something more than an apology to say when I look the world in the eye. I'll tell you, man, my friend William came to me with a message of hope. It went fuck you and everything that you think you know. If you don't step outside, the things that you believe, they're gonna kill you. Said no one's gonna stop you from dying young and miserable and right. If you want something better, you gotta put that shit aside. I thought about how for thousands of years, there have been people who told us that things can't go on like this. From Jesus Christ to the diggers, from Malthus to Zerson, from Karl Marx to Huey Newton, but the shit goes on and on. She wrote. Well, song was quite vulgar. Mm -hmm. Actually, it bothers him. It doesn't at all. <laughs> it entertains me a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. So, what we got lyric wise, oh. bud? He's disgusting. He hasn't bathed in months. But you know it's not because he's been fighting some kind of morals. I don't know how he said that word. It's a long word. Wait, wait, where? B-O-U-R-G-E-O-I-S. Bjorgius? Bjorgius? Morals. He's just lazy and young. Hmm. Yeah, there was, there was, there was some good lines in there. Yeah. But like overall lyrically, I didn't really connect with with a lot of it. I agree. With I, that. There was some like, there was some drug stuff at the beginning. Um, with the spoon and whatnot, all those. Yeah. Um. And won't so yeah, there's there's there a lot of stuff that I didn't really connect with, but there were some really good lines in the song for sure. Yeah. Um, his vocals were were uh, I really uh, maybe it's just growing on me a little bit, but. I like yeah, I like the vocals here too, especially here. Yeah, um, and then uh, I really was digging the guitar the way that he was uh, playing that. Oh yeah, but that's it was definitely I felt. definitely 
instrumentally, it was definitely a bop. Yeah. But as far as lyrics, obviously, I'm with you. I didn't relate to a lot of them. Sure. But I definitely, I can get behind them. But, All right. yeah. Where are you going writing-wise? Mm. I think I'm going to gonna go with a 5.8, and okay. I'm going to put it in a playlist. Okay. I'm going to go with a 5.5. This is not going to make a playlist, yeah. but I definitely am starting to warm up a little bit to that sound, I think, like yeah. I said, folk punk, because, like, typically when I'm listening, you know, when I initially was listening to some of it, I was like, I'm, like, happy with this song. I'm like, man, I am just not enjoying this. Yeah. And now I'm like, like this song, for example, I was like, half of this song, I'm like, oh, okay, I wonder where this is going to go. And it wasn't in love with it, but right. I definitely didn't hate it by yeah. any means. So I think, you know, slowly broadening, guys. Yeah, Slowly. and honestly, I've the more higher paced folk punk. Yes, I, I that's grown on me a lot. Yeah, definitely enjoyed that. Okay, nice. This is a little slower paced compared comparatively, comparatively. but yeah. yeah. Anything else on it? Just ready for my f bombs. Send it, bud. All right. <clears throat> so the the f bombs here are very simple. That there was a there was a fuck the police in there, because you know w- what kind of song doesn't have that. Yeah. And then there was a fuck you and everything you think you know. If you don't step outside the thing that you believe, they're gonna kill you. And I enjoy that. That was solid. Yeah. So um, overall, with these f bombs, I think I'm just gonna go with a simple rating of seven point eight. Okay. They're very solid, but they don't. And they don't overdo them. Yeah. But they overdo all the other cussing. <laughs> I mean, I enjoyed it, and but Chuck there was a lot. <laughs> you gained points for, for that from Chuck. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Anything else, bud? No, that's all I got on Guys, this one. we're two boys, one brain cell. I'm Joel Norton, and that is Charles Beeson. If you enjoyed our reaction slash review, do us a favor, hit that like button, and come subscribe if you want to join the community. Oh, yeah. Until next time, guys. Peace out.